Request has been denied. I can't hear you. I'm at the bottom of the Your I can't hear you. Your request has been denied. What does that mean? Uh, it's 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 his thing. Sneeze Master, your request has been denied. But you're not the Sneeze Master. I am now. You sick bastard. Hey! Hey, get back here! Oh, my leg! Oh! Oh! Ooh, daddy. Ooh, boy. to everyone's favorite game show, Are You Stronger Than a Fifth Grader? Before we get started, let's meet our contestants. From London, Ontario, we have Arthur Hansen, a history professor that currently teaches at Western University. Arthur, how are we doing today? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm doing good. Uh, sorry, did you say this was the, that this show was called Are You Stronger Than a Fifth Grader? Yes, sir, you're right. Yeah, I thought this was the set for are, are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? Oh, well I'm sorry to hear that. This isn't that show. Well, yeah, I mean, I know, I mean, now I know. I, I, I kind of knew something was up when you uh, put a bag over my head and uh, shoved me in the back of a truck. And our other contestant is from Ajax, Ontario, and is named Bones. Um, uh, <laughs> that's... That's not a fifth grader, that's a, that's a full grown man. That's, a, that's, not, that's not fair, that's not fair. Oh, except he isn't. Bones is only 10 years old, and at the age of three accidentally took genetically enhancing drug that changed his life forever. At the age of four, Bones began lifting weights, and his personal trainers include Dwayne Johnson, Hulk Hogan, and The Undertaker. The Undertaker? By the age of 9, Bones had won 11 weightlifting championships, including the 2016 North American Weightlifting Championships. Bones, how are we doing today? Fantastic! Fantastic? What do you mean fantastic? He didn't say any words! He just grunted! And the official fight will begin in 60 seconds. Uh, this disembodied voice, uh... Would it, would it be okay if I just didn't do this? I haven't worked out in like eight months. Do you mean eight years? It's okay, yes, eight years! I... Come on! I'm sorry, Arthur, but you did sign a contract that said you agreed to fight to the death with a genetically enhanced ten-year-old boy. Fight to the death? Uh, yes. That's what I just said. Look, Mr... Sorry, what was your name? That's not important. Mister, that's not important. Oh, that's... Look, could you just find it in your heart to let me out of this situation? No. And that's the beginning of the fight! Just remember, gentlemen, there's only one rule and one rule only. That is, there is absolutely no rules whatsoever. Biting, hair pulling, and crotch kicking is strongly encouraged. Don't be fooled by Gary the referee. He will not step in at any point. Arthur, it's been nice knowing you. Go get him, Bones.
you wanted to, uh, to meet here? Yeah, I just, uh, I, I have all the stuff in the... Oh, room. cool, yeah. It's, it's a little heavy, so I just uh, sort of rolled over. Yeah, 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 sure, yeah. It's, uh, it's, actually, it's not that bad, yeah, I'll just bring in my car. Yeah, it's a lot. I, I, you asked for a lot, so I was like, hey, a whole suitcase is... Yeah, it's, it's great, thanks. I'm just gonna... Hey, hey, wait, wait, hey, just, uh, if, if you can, you know... Can. I brought you all the stuff, so like... Yeah, so. thanks, yeah. Yes, money, money, yeah. Oh yeah, I thought I thought you got my text. I can't, uh, can't pee right now. Do it another time, but. Uh... I mean, that now is pretty good. Yeah, but I, I, I can't is what I expressed. All over text when I text. Well, no, 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 no. I just need it right now. Okay, just you right. need to stop being a piece of shit. I'm sorry. <laughs> No, 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 I, I, I just, I love you I'm so sorry, uh, fucking sorry. much, you know, I love you so much. <laughs> Dana, honey, don't worry, someone's here to fix this. I'm just gonna go. I think they're here right now. Just hold it. Hold on tight, Dana. Just hold on tight. Hi. <laughs> good, good, good. Right, right over here. Okay, so what kind of. Uh, yeah. Oh, holy shorts. My yeah. god, that is a situation you have got over there. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a tent. I'm really glad you're here. Yes, so, yes, yes. So just first get, off, you know, do it quick. Just I'll get it over start it. off by writing my name. My name is Father. Well, you can just tell me your name. I, I just did a situation. Father. Father. <laughs> Joe. You're not gonna. Man, no, I should just start that. No, 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 no. Man, it's, okay. it's okay. I. F B. You can. That doesn't sound right. Um. Anyway. Um. So what exactly do you want me to perform here? Right uh, now? I, I, Exorcism, you know, she's got some kind of evil demon in her, like she's doing these weird actions, as you can see, they, they, it's crazy. Your mother is rotting in hell! Uh, personal jab right there, I'm she, very sorry to hear about That's that. not like her, you know, she's very sensitive when it comes to... Yes, I can, I can tell by the flower shirt, it's a very nice shirt, just her personality seems to be uh, in, a, in a terrible uh, situation right yeah, now. Yeah, 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 so if you could get the demon out of her, then we could just... Yes! at all, no. Um, I will say right now, we, all we need is my, oh my god, this material is really not very good for, uh, for holding paper, you know? I'm talking about this shirt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just and the paper, paper, too, is really not helpful. I'll yeah, sure, that. sure. We can talk about your shirt later, but can you exercise my wife, please? Yeah, um, here's the thing. I just, um, it's been a really stressful day, you know? I had to, I had to bike over to my friend's house. We're in a Christian metal group. Uh, we're called Holy Disciples. Uh, it's really, really quite a quite a good thing. We're actually playing at the ACL. Father we don't have time for this. My wife, I'm afraid for her health. All right, uh, just come here for a second. Okay, I I don't know if you can tell, but I am stalling so hard right yes, now. Yes, I can tell you're stalling. Why are you stalling? Because this is my first exorcism ever. First. This is my first exorcism. I've never done this before. I will so over you and everyone. Now, I do not like the sound of that. You have to fix it. Okay, all right, all right, I'll fix it. Okay, just, just give me a second. I just, I just wanna, I just wanna sing one of my songs. You're gonna sing? It, it, hey, it relaxes me. Okay, it relaxes okay, me. Okay. It puts me in a good place. Okay. God, I love you, but this is unacceptable. I'm taking it off for this. 
Jesus was a man with a beard, and he wore flip-flops. What, what is, is this? this? Jesus was a man with a soul, I don't like and, like this. and gave it Make to it everyone. Stop. Make it stop! I think it's working. His name was Jesus! Hello, new recruits. All right, uh, how are we doing today? Uh, my name is Brian, and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how you can be really good employees here at Frank's Supermarket. Now, before we get started, there are a few things I just want to tell you about, okay? First off, never be afraid to ask questions, okay? The only way you're going to learn is by asking questions, so don't ever be afraid to ask anything at all, okay? You can never ask too many questions. Alex! Who is my father? 
Alex, when I, when I mean don't be afraid to ask questions, I, I, I mean about the store in, specif in specificity. Uh, because I, 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 don't, I can't tell you who your, your father is. I, I just don't know that. Bummer. Ronald? Sometimes I inquire about situations of which I do not understand. But then my inquiries get interpreted in the wrong way. Would that be a problem here? No, that shouldn't be an issue. Uh, shouldn't be a problem at all because we, we want a, a good environment here. Uh, we are not going to judge anybody based on any questions that they ask. As long as it's not inappropriate, but I'm sure you're not going to ask anything inappropriate. Okay, um, I just want you guys to also know harassment uh, in the workplace is strictly strictly prohibited, the major problem. We do not take it lightly. So if you guys feel harassed in any way, shape, or form, or see somebody else being harassed, please let me know or another manager know as soon as possible. Alex. Why is my father? Why is my father? That's your question? Because because, just because. Cool. Ronald? I have a tendency to stare. Some might say that's harassment. I am sorry. Would that be a problem? Well, I mean, it, um, if, if you do it a lot and it really makes people uncomfortable, I, yeah, but maybe just Maybe just try and limit it. If it is an issue, though, that you have, maybe maybe I can talk to someone. But just, let's just try and, and not stare too much. Great. Awesome. Awesome. Perfect. Great. Last thing is that, look, being a cashier is a hard job. There's a lot of hard customers that you deal with. So I want you guys to know that if any customer is ever rude to you, I will be there to support you, okay? And if any customer is ever rude to you, any of you, let me know, all right? I feel the need to inform you that at my last job, it was a restaurant. A customer came to me, was being very rude. After I took her order, I followed her home. I figured out where she worked. I figured out where her children went to school. One day, I burned the house down. Unfortunately, they survived. They are hiding. But I will find them. I will find them. Would that be a problem? Yeah, yeah, that's a pretty huge red flag actually yeah that would be quite an issue um please don't commit arson i'm gonna have to alex when will i follow oh my god come on <laughs>